Hello and welcome! In this video I'm going through the roadmap that was announced by Anthem yesterday. It's a great bit of news. I'm the babe lover, let's get straight to it! As you see, the first piece of DLC named Echoes of Reality will release in March. Act 2 and 3 aren't announced yet, so we don't know what they will offer. But I bet they will release in one or two months after Act 1. We have a lot to grind for in the coming months, and I knew it, I just knew it, and I said it, Bioware wouldn't disappoint. In just two weeks we can play it. For the lucky ones, next week for Origin and EA Access users. I play on PS4, so no early access for me. The content that is in the first DLC are new events, quality of life improvements, new rewards like weapons and armor, Maybe new abilities too. Expanded progression system. I bet this is a level race. And new stronghold. It says stronghold, so one more stronghold to play. Guilds and leaderboards will be added. Finally, we can make clans. And we don't know how many we can have in a guild, but that will be announced at a later date. And they haven't quite figured out how leaderboards will work yet, but. They want people to compete. Uh, don't worry, no PvP. The next thing, new missions. This I love. In Destiny, we have to wait three months for a big update with poor story. So, so I like the emphasis on story in this game. The last bit is the Cataclysm. This will be the most epic thing in the whole game. Shape of Storms everyone. So, in update 1 we get an evolving world, like new events, quality of life updates, new rewards, expanded progression system. In update 2, stronger together, new stronghold, guilds and leaderboards, and new missions. In update 3, Cataclysm, the Cataclysm will arrive! <laughs> I can't wait! Now this is how I think the content will be in every update. Update 1, week 1, update 2, week 2, and update 3, week 3. Or instead of weeks, it's months, but I highly doubt that. But we'll see in March. If you're wondering what was in the demo on the last day, it was a precursor that works its way up to a cataclysm. What's the difference between a precursor and a cataclysm? Think about it this way. Before a fire becomes a raging inferno, it starts out with a spark. Maybe some kindling, some light smoke. Then it feeds, gets larger, hotter, brighter. It becomes something that only a f firefighter can stop. We'll get more gameplay next week, in the form of a stream. I'm thinking we do an anthem stream next week. Ben Irving, you in? I'm down, let's do it. There's a lot to look forward to in the coming weeks, months and years. Bioware is taking the reins and they will show all the haters what they are capable of. What's your favorite thing about this announcement? Comment below. This was the latest details on Anthem. Thank you for watching, you are awesome. Like this video and subscribe to be part of the awesome gang. And remember to hit that bell button to get the latest updates on Anthem. Thank you. I love you all and be kind to one another. Until next time.